She has to be here someplace. Diana! Brian, come on. Let's go back inside. No. Not until I've found her. She's not here. She's with her lover. That's impossible. She thinks he's dead. Like I said, the powers of the Bermuda Triangle are in full force tonight. Anything, even that which seems impossible, can happen. Time, space, every dimension can be crossed, broken through. Doc, just ease up on that for a second, will you? Diana was remembering her lover tonight. Her memories were so strong and so desperate that using the power of the Bermuda Triangle as a catalyst, she somehow crossed over and found a way to join him. Diana found him when she went out into the ocean, and then again out on her balcony, she danced with him. I'm, but this time now, it, it seems like much more. If you're right, Doc, if the powers of the triangle are that strong, capable of crossing all barriers, then she must have crossed over to be with the one she loves. If that's true, if she went back to be with him, I'll never see her again. I'm not giving up hope. No way. If Diana can cross over to another dimension to hook up with this man from her past, then it has to be possible for her to cross back. Anything is possible, as long as the power remains this forceful. Well, then she can come back. It's not for me to say. We had a connection, Diana and I. Maybe it wasn't as strong as what she had with this other man, but it was growing. So I think right now I just need to focus on that connection. How do you mean, Brian? I'm gonna see if it can't help pull Diana back to me. I'm not giving up on her. I haven't really lost her. I don't believe that. No. I can't have. And I can come back. She will. Doc, do you really think she can cross back over, even if she's gone to her lover? Anything is possible, but right now we, we're still not even sure where she's actually gone. What do you mean? Did Diana go back to her former life where this man is living? Or if he's dead, like Diana thought, did she somehow find a way to cross over to him on the other side? No. I don't believe that. I'm not giving up hope. And I am not leaving here until I find her. Doc. What do you really think? It's hard to say or even make a guess. Nothing is as it seems tonight. It's getting a little nippy out here. We don't want you catching cold. All I can think, feel, and hear is Diana. Brian, you know, I hate to bring you down, but, you know, there's a possibility, a very real possibility, that Diana might not come back. And you've got to be ready to accept that. But she is coming back, Liz. I can feel it. Like I said before, you know, even with her amnesia, she still remembers the love she had for that other man. I know. You know, he's still very much in her heart. I mean, their love was so powerful that even though Diana has lost so much of her life, <laughs> she doesn't even know who she is, she still clings to her love for him. I understand that. Now, Brian, it's not just some ordinary love. It's one of those once-in-a-lifetime passions that can transcend time and space. Brian, I, I really didn't mean to be so insensitive. No. You're just telling me what you think I needed to hear. It's because I care for you. I don't want to see you get hurt. You know, you're right, Liz. 
I am going about this the total wrong way. I, I want Diana to come back to me more than anything else in this world. But I can't force it. I can't will it to happen. That wouldn't be right. No. I'm just going to have to leave it up to those forces that made it possible for her to reunite with this man from her past. Whatever happens, happens. Whatever happens, happens. But that doesn't mean that I'm giving up hope. That doesn't mean that I'm going to stop praying for her to come back to me. But when she comes back to me, I want it to be because she wants to come back to me. I want her to come back to me free and clear. Her, her feelings come first. Her happiness comes first. My feelings, everything else, it comes second. I want her to know how much I love her and I'll take care of her if she comes back. If her happiness is with this other man, then so be it. I'll accept it. But if her happiness is with me, I swear to you, I will never let her go again. Not ever. I saw from up in the hotel, the lights in the sky are starting to flicker, grow dimmer. What does that mean? The power of the Bermuda Triangle is fading out. It's almost over. What is? Spell it out, would you, Doc? When the lights go out, the power will die, and things will go back to normal. Normal? So does that mean that Diana will be back? It means whatever side Diana's on when the lights go out is the side she'll stay on forever. If Diana's not here by the time the lights go out completely, she'll never be back. They're almost out. I love you, Diana. Come back to me, please.